We are rolling out three additional products before we start onboarding you into the bank. Number one, we are going to have discounts on gift cards. Amazon gift cards, JCPenney gift cards, um, Cracker Barrel gift cards, you name it, best gift cards. If you buy $100 cards and you only pay $75 for it, is that a good, how much money did you save? Everybody buys cars. You all drove here in a car. Most of us buy used cars. Why? Because of the de depreciation when you roll it off the lot. None of you have ever had a concierge. You go to a dealership and you hope you can trust them. My boy worked for a dealership forever and I hoped I could trust him. My car's in the shop right now. <laughs> it's not their fault, but, but at the end of the day, you hope you can trust them. Let me tell you what our car concierge is. It's going to be called Our Cars. It's going to cost you a few points. It's going to be way under Blue Book, low Blue Book. Why? There's no flooring lines. There's no lot to pay for. There's no upkeep. They're going to buy you your car, the exact car you want, the make, the mileage, everything you want delivered directly to your doorstep way under Blue Book. Is that worth something? Yeah. How would you like to be able to get your next door neighbor that you overheard, he's in the market for a car and say, do you have a concierge? No, I'm just going to go look at Ken Garf and uh, Larry H. Miller. And what if I could have you go do that and let me to my concierge see if we can kill the price? The exact car you want. You use a couple hundred points. You go by and let him use your concierge, and bada bing, bada boom, he thinks you walk on water because you saved him 10% under low blue book and it was delivered to his doorstep and he, was, he or she was happy as heck. You know what you get to tell a man? Thanks, I just made some money on you buying that car. Think it'll be easy to recruit when that happens? That's coming online here shortly. See the power of this? We're not doing this because I want your 68 bucks. We're not doing this because I want your $38. Write this down. The reason you're paying $38, it's a rule for me, in order to pay people for swipes, you have to pay a greens fee. Does everybody understand that? When you go into Costco and they're getting a Citibank card, and everybody knows what they are, because we have them. The Citibank card, that's not a Costco employee, and it's definitely not a Citibank employee. If somebody paid the right to sign the book the business there at the Costco, it happens all over state fairs. It happens at college campuses. I'm paying you for people's swipes. I have to charge that fee. Well, there's a, the banks over here telling me I have to charge a fee, and then I've got FTC over here saying you better have a product, or you can't pay out compensation. That's why the rewards network here. Does everybody understand? Yes. Holy moly. Quit selling the reward program. The rewards program is cool. Sell what we have. What we have is we're building a distribution model for us to compete against Walmart. Please understand the reason I have you even sitting in this room is I want tens of thousands, millions of you out there that when Walmart gets their card, we're already killing it. Can you see what we're doing? Now, why didn't I put a kibosh on Walmart? I'll tell you why. It's credibility. You sell a, a customer a $150 card, they get to swipe all they want, get all the savings they want. You guys are gonna be able to go into any mom and pop store and sign them up for free, and when the car gets there, they're gonna give them a discount. Walmart's not going to have that. Oh, and by the way, your customer doesn't have to pay a monthly fee. Walmart does. Eight bucks a month. Are we going to kill them or not? Of course we are. Are we bringing something that's absolutely revolutionizing the world? Yeah. Are you selling a lotion, potion, powder, or pill? No. A couple hundred points, you're just going to save your neighbor on their cars. Every time you get one, you're going to get a concierge. 
Does everybody see what we're doing here? This isn't a multi-level. This is a distribution network called our network. And the bigger we get, the better it's going to get. The power is in the network. We're selling two things. You guys, the network, and the rev card. Everybody asks me, what's the magic in this rev card? The magic is not the rev card. That's cool. There's not one stitch, not one stitch of technology in there that's not already in your phone. Not one ounce. We were smart enough to take the chip and go and put it this way instead of this way. Woo! What's the magic? We own the banks. When that card's presented, the lion's share goes to the banks. The banks give it to me and I pay it to you. We treat you like our business partners. We're going to continue to bring you. The bigger you get, the better it will get. We're going to make sure that every benefit, and I don't care if you work for the church, I don't care if you work for the government, you're going to have the same type of benefits that they have based on you getting me big enough. And I'm not just talking about you people here in Utah or in the Continental Union in the United States. I'm talking about all 82 countries that we're opening in. Does that make sense? Do you see how we're making you our partners? Because we're going to get to the point where giving away a card is going to be absolutely easy. Trust me. You're going to have hundreds of customers because they're going to want that card just from the savings alone when they present that card at retail establishments.